Search impression share in Google Ads is a really important metric to know and understand when managing your search campaigns. In this video, we're going to talk about firstly, what search impression share is. Secondly, why it's important to pay attention to, and it's really important for the growth and scale of your campaigns. Third, where you're going to find it in your ad account. And lastly, what are the factors that might be bringing down your impression share? And it's one of two factors, and that will help you solve the problem of getting a low impression share. So let's go do this right now. Okay, welcome to the Teach Traffic YouTube channel. My name's Alana, and in this video, as I mentioned, we're going to talk about impression share or search impression share, which is the impression share for your search campaigns. What actually is search impression share? Essentially, it's the metric in percentage terms that Google tells you how often your ad was shown versus how often you wanted your ad to be shown. So contrary to what you might think, when you bid on a keyword, your ad is not shown every single time somebody searches for that keyword. Perhaps you've tested this yourself when you've bidding on a keyword and you've done an actual Google search to see if your ad shows up. Your ad is not always shown because you're competing with competitors and Google are always testing which ad and which competitor is going to be performing better. So your search impression share is often not 100%, but obviously if you've got a good keyword, you want that search impression share metric to be as high as possible. So let's talk about why impression share is actually so important with the management and scale of your campaigns. And basically it's because it tells you how much traffic really you're missing out on. And this is particularly relevant for your money keywords or your best performing keywords. You want that search impression share to be as high as possible for your best keywords. But if your search impression share is low, then it's generally due to one of two reasons, which is either due to budget constraints or your ad rank. Now, historically, Google would tell you which of those two components were bringing down your impression share. Now, they're always making changes. They only tell you your impression share due to your ad rank. And I'm going to show you where you can find this out right now. So here I am in my Google ad account and I've navigated already to a search campaign. And I'm gonna assume you don't have these columns already set up in your view, because I'm gonna show you where it is. So we click, um, we go to the columns and we go to modify columns and you'll see here this competitive metric groupings of all our metrics that we wanna have a look at. So here are the available uh, separate metrics that we can look at. So we can find the search impression share. And, and as you can see here, when I hover over it, it actually tells me the definition. And it also breaks down when the search impression share, when I was in what's called top IS, which is top impression share, which is when the amount of times that my ad was in that top ad stack and the search impression share when I was in the absolute top. That is the number one ad position, okay? And it also tells me how much search impression, sorry, this, this thing keeps coming up, um, how much search impression share was lost due to rank and how much lost top impression share was due to rank. So if I click on uh, these as well to show you, and I'm gonna click apply, and then I'm gonna scroll across and you'll see here, so I've got a bunch of different ad groups here. So this was a campaign that I was running for a retargeting challenge that would, you know, teaches people how to create a retargeting campaign on Facebook and Google. So I was bidding on keywords about Google retargeting, Facebook retargeting, etc. So I separated them by ad group. So we can see the search impression share for the different keywords was quite different. So I was missing out on a lot of traffic for my Google retargeting keywords, but I was getting more traffic, a more proportion of the overall traffic for my Facebook retargeting. For people who were, were typing in retargeting course, I was getting 50% of the impressions, so much more, but there is obviously significant less volume of available traffic. Okay, so scrolling across here, this is gonna tell me why, or, or how much uh, of a problem my ad rank was, which was contributing to uh, me missing out on impression share. So for my Google retargeting type keywords, 
50% of the time it was due to my ad rank. Now, if you remember, ad rank is a mixture of my bid strategy as well as my quality score. So to improve the impression share that was um, and really ca caused by you know a reduction due to the ad rank, then I can look to either improve my quality score or possibly bid a little bit higher. You know, I can also deduce that, um, you know, considering half of it was due to ad rank, the other half would be due to budget constraints. So I could also increase the overall campaign budget for this particular campaign as well. And so down, coming down here to the to the type of keywords where I was getting almost a 50% impression share, I only missed out on 20% of those keywords due to a low ad rank or a lower ad rank compared to my competitors. So I could once again, hopefully try and increase quality score. Uh, and I've actually got a video on steps you can take to improve quality score. And I'll put a link to it in the description and I could possibly even bid higher or change my bid strategy. So I'm capturing and I'm outbidding other people. Okay, so that's how you can find your impression share as well as um, also see here search top impression share when I was in that top ad stack versus when I was in that number one ad position as well. So there you have it. Hopefully now you understand firstly what search impression share is. You can appreciate why it's so important and steps you can take to improve it. If you like this video, don't forget, hit that like button, subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching.